So I think break of the atom and vegetal life is my most ambitious and largest project so far. So I have chosen Farhan Zaid as an icon whose works I look at and draw inspiration from. But I present the work with a new perspective. I look at the work in in the contemporary and the here and the now. And my work looks at nature in the context of histories of war and neglect and contemporary issues of climate change. So I want the viewer to have an experience looking at the monumental scale. I want the viewer to get lost in the details and also to think about how nature and how how much hope there is for us in the world. How we need to live in a symbiotic world of multi-species collaboration in which all forms live in harmony and peace. So that is the message I want to give to the audiences through my work. And that is that is what I want them to take away when they look at my work. So as a diver and a marine researcher, I've been looking at and diving deep into the sea, looking at several archaeological sunken war wrecks which have been underwater for for decades. So what happens is over time, you know, botanical forms take over these man-made structures and they become organic. You know, these war machines which are symbols of violence and destruction now become symbols of hope and rebirth.